Ladies and gentlemen, it is time. You might want to put your Kasuba as hide your wives. Drop a thumbs Top up. Five ghosts getting into caught it, on man. camera. I'm high. Just passing by. Facebook user Sandra Fulton Hamilton John shares a short video of her friend Jack Panera in which she believes that he accidentally captured proof of the paranormal. Accidentally? In the video, Jack, who is deaf, is talking in sign language with his girlfriend when something unexpected makes a sudden appearance. Ow. Ow. Yeah, man, put your guts to bed. What? Did something? Oh, damn. That, that kind of shook me for a second. Jack is completely unaware of the strange dark figure that quickly darts past him in the background. What? Even stranger, when the footage is brightened and slowed down, this figure appears to have no visible features that catch the light. Oh, so did Jack damn. accidentally capture a ghost on camera? Or is it something else? Your thoughts? Thoughts? Let me know what you think. Damn, that's bizarre. The that's passenger. really bizarre. Facebook user Mario Lara claims that ever since the opening of his party and event store in Guadalajara, Mexico, strange events started to take place inside his store. <laughs> when he captures the alleged activity on camera and shares it to his Facebook page, his videos go viral. In fact, a short while ago, I featured the story of Mario and his store on this channel. If you're new, subscribe to Nukes Top 5 and also me if you're trying to grow out here. From piñata spinning on their own, to workers getting spooked by unexplained flying objects, to one late night when a terrifying figure seems to emerge from a pile of pinatas. What? I feel like I've and seen more this recently, clip. Mario experiences a drill starting on its own, dangerously close to his feet. This is, I feel like I've, I feel like I've seen that clip, but not this version. I still have to finish putting it together. And then this. What? What? All what of the, the bizarre activity Mario blames on a single seemingly possessed pinata that continuously seems to move on its own. Bro, like that's like dog. Dog, that's looking demonic. Yo, would you actually have that? I mean, if you have a store and that, that, that's selling stuff like that, that's kind of understandable. But would you actually keep stuff like that in your home? I mean, if you got kids around, then those kids would be like, yo, mommy, mommy, I want to get those Barbie dolls and shies like that. I mean, damn, man, these stuff be demonic, bro. Watch out, man. And I kept it locked. Oh, my God. Let's take a look. Hey. Now Mario <laughs> says he is so terrified of Yo, he got scared. It only fell on the ground. M must be gravity. Pinata that he called for a shaman to take it from him in hopes that the haunting events in his store would stop. Damn. However, after the pinata is taken, the activity only seems to get worse. When the shaman tells Mario that he left the pinata in an abandoned car in the middle of nowhere, Mario decides to retrieve it, hoping that bringing the pinata back will actually calm down the bizarre activity in his store. Damn. He broadcasts his car drive to pick up the pinata live on his Facebook page. And of course, it did not go well. Ow! Yo, I'm ready. Okay, I'm ready, bro. Tonight, I'm driving in Tobaga. Okay, bro. Earlier today, I got a WhatsApp message from a guy saying that he will give me the piñata, but that he can't hand it to me in person. So is he going to the store? Picking it up? He told me that I would find it inside a car. That, why? So we're going to that place? Okay, that doesn't sound normal. Like... After a long drive, he reaches his destination and leaves his vehicle in search of the abandoned car in which supposedly he can find the pinata. Bruh, you could have, you could have gone there at daytime. No way, I feel like I'm hearing things, but I don't know if it's my imagination. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey. <laughs> what a spooky feeling! I felt like someone. Oh my god, I got spooked. Guys, there's the car. But why would you? Is it? Is he live here? Is it? The car's there, but it's very. Couldn't read it. 
Oh my god, bro, no, 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 I can't, bro, like, it's no. very steep. No, I feel like this is made up, made up stuff, bro. Like, made up stuff. Why? The bag is brand new, there, I'll find the... Wow, it's very steep. Oh my god, yo, he's gonna get up and... Oh, it's very steep. Grab it, grab it. No, don't grab it. I mean, it's a trap. It's a trap. Uh-oh. Oh. Mario hears strange noises and feels like he's being followed, but eventually he finds the pinata. He takes it back to his car and starts his drive home. And this is when things get truly terrifying. Okay, when he got home, so he's driving. I'm far from periphery. Around the map. Yo, I have a feeling that the piñata will just raise from the back. Damn, get ready, boys. I'm assuming that. Around the Matalan. Yeah. Baby, baby, baby. I feel like someone's even behind him. There are like too many potholes. It's like almost impossible to drive here. Yo, is it is is it outside of outside or in his car? I feel like it was outside. He's going 36 right now. Go speed up, King. 40. Now slow down, homie. No way, no way. Yo, yo, stop looking like that, man. Stop doing that, bro. Whoa. Stop moving your camera, man. Nothing's going to happen. Nothing's going to happen. Pray, 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 bro. Calm down. Yo, this is bad. Like, why are you trying? Oh, he crashes his car? Yo, boom, boom, God. No, okay, listen, we should not laugh. Um, but I, okay, if he crashes his car, is it legit? We don't know if he really crashed or not. Okay, he will, will he show? I think he really, yeah, he really did. Damn, son. Damn, son. So it looks like he was really scared, but listen, man. He shouldn't have been filming with one hand and driving him with another. Um, you know that I was I, I was gonna say that honestly, but the car crashed before I could say that. Uh, thankfully he uh, he's fine. He was on he was going forty, so it's not that bad. It's bad, but not I uh, yeah it's bad. Rips. Yeah, rips. And <laughs> but, but thankfully he's fine. You know. Was there a car that went past? Yo, I I don't know, man. Thankfully, he's fine, though. Okay, he's walking. Why are you not taking your Mario car? hears a blood-curdling scream, which shakes him up so badly that he eventually crashes his car. After he inspects the outside of his vehicle, he seems to make a run for it, and the live stream mysteriously ends. Now... What's truly creepy about this footage is something a few alert viewers pointed out in Mario's comments. You see, right before Mario hears the yeah. scream and crashes his car, something absolutely horrifying can be seen sitting right behind Mario in the back seat of his car. Oh, damn. I'm Yo, bro, early, earlier I got spooked out too. I couldn't see. I thought there was a shadow, but I didn't see that. I thought that there was somebody and I got spooked out too. But I was like, okay, probably I'm just imagining because the quality is so bad. Damn. Oh. But so could it be that Mario right, made the wrong decision in picking up the allegedly cursed pinata that he believes yeah. caused the haunting in his store? Yeah, because like not only that he went to a place where it was completely abandoned, it was put in a abandoned car, a car that is totally totaled, totally wrecked. I, I just don't understand why he would leave there, uh, and you're going there at night time, and also you're, you you just crash your car. So that's like what you gotta spend like five hundred dollars. I'm not even sure. Like any any scientist around in my chat, let me know how much does it cost. I don't have a car, man. I got an electric scooter. That's it, man. <laughs> and just that, what yeah, man, is this damn son you decide 
Yeah, guys, don't do if that, If you see man, a video nighttime? that you think would be perfect, gmail did. Don't do that. For no, over three. two years, Lee and his family have been experiencing terrifying paranormal activity in their home in Lee, England. The scary unexplained occurrences became so frequent that Lee now dedicates his YouTube channel, Really Haunted, to documenting as much of the supernatural events as he can. If Lee seems familiar, it might be because I featured a few of his creepy videos before. If you don't remember or you're new to the channel, here's a quick recap of Lee's terrifying captures in his home. Uh oh Yeah, that thing do be kind of moving. What? Oh, snap. Yeah, he got cats and dogs that are also freaked out. Bruh, that's a whole lot of activity, though. What? It became white. What? Like something is moving. Oh, my God. And the activity hasn't stopped since. Late one night after Lee nods off to sleep on the couch in the living room, he captures something on camera once again. All of it while fast asleep and completely oblivious to the creepy events happening around him. Are there wires attached or? Honey, I'm home. Peekaboo, let's take the clothes off. <laughs> Damn, son, that's kind of wild. Like, let us A teddy bear seat. sitting in the corner of the living room gets violently thrown into the air at incredible speed and lands on the floor off camera. Then, as Lee is still fast asleep on the couch, something slowly pulls down his cover. Damn. As a very deep sleeper, Lee says that he had no idea what was happening in the same room with him late that night. He it's only discovered sleeper. the shocking activity when he looked back at the CCTV footage. Another night, and Lee and his wife are fast asleep in bed at four in the morning. They capture something again. Something truly bizarre and Ow. a bit disturbing. Truly bizarre? Yo, I, I don't understand this. Don't they have a policy of never showing on the camera? <laughs> never showing up on the camera? That's like a white mist or like smoke, smoke. Um, wisp? Is that what you call it? I don't know. Let me try to fire one bullet. Let me see if I can put a hole in that. Well, I kind of scared it away. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. A white Spike translucent mist like right shape slowly creeps into frame, seemingly hovering over the sleeping and defenseless couple. Then the shape slowly vanishes just as mysteriously as it appeared. Lee believes it was a ghost that was watching them as they slept. The same ghost that has been terrorizing the family over the course of two years. So what do you think? Two years? Is it real? You decide. You can check. Like, uh, if you have been terrorized for two years like that, you gotta piece the f out or call some religious people and do the uh, I don't know what's the term exorcism or something like that. Is that is that the actual term? I I don't know. Like, but basically what I'm trying to say here is that like, get some religious people out there, do their stuff like pray, clean the home and stuff like that. You know what I mean, right? Check out Lee's YouTube channel for more creepy videos at Really Haunted. Purify the room and shiza like that. Meanwhile, on TikTok. Number two. TikTok user Carolina Giselle from from Argentina says that she watched a very strange film that is said to be cursed by a demonic presence. Carolina says that after watching the video, strange things began to happen around her home. Damn. One night, Yo, what's the name? Uh, so I don't watch it, you know. Carolina is playing a scary video game with her friend and broadcasting it live on TikTok. Damn. Then something happens that's a bit odd. Was I here already? Yes. Did that fall off by itself? Yes. A tissue roll sitting on the table in front of them gets knocked to the floor, startling both Carolina and her friend. Now, that's certainly not so disturbing, but over the course of the next couple of weeks, more creepy incidents begin to take place inside Carolina's home, and she records it all. 
Hola, puedo. Okay, now I cannot read that. Uh, yeah, well, I woke up because I heard some noises. And I'm home alone. It looks like there's nothing here. Oh my god, bro, that freaked me. Those eyes freaked me the F out, but it's just a camera thing with the cats or the pet. Damn, son. Damn, man. Carolina wakes to some odd noises. And when she checks her house, she finds nothing. But a door slams right behind her, seemingly on its own. Again, this is not necessarily so disturbing, but then things take a turn toward the truly bizarre. Uh oh! Truly bizarre audio altered due to copyright. Got you. I don't know what the heck that. Yeah, I'm not playing, bro. I'm not playing, man. Oh my god, what's happening? Dude, that reflection is messing me up, man. I'm ready to bust more. <laughs> Someone or something outside roughly taps on Carolina's windows, but when she goes to check, there's nothing there. But the strange activity in Carolina's home begins to become a bit more intense. A bit more intense. Okay, so cupboard would open, I'm assuming. Oh, snap. No music. Complete. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn. The way she screamed, man, that was funny. Oh, snap. I'm gonna bust through the. Yo. Back away. Back away, missus. Back away. I'm out of ammo. Snap, I gotta reload. E your ammo cost ammo and then is very expensive. One now, night, bro. something terrifying happens that chills Carolina to the bone. Oh snap, boys, it's getting ready. Dude, I need to save ammo. I feel like that I've been firing just randomly a lot. But I'm just scared, man. I'm just trying to scare the ghost away, dog. But okay, this is a moment. But I need to start saving ammo, bro. Oh my god! Oh my god! We'll be... I'm gonna aim down side so I don't just shoot out of my hip, you know? Oh my god! Yo, turn the lights on! Turn the turn the turn the lights on, man! Oh man, music went away. Oh snap! It's about to happen. Okay, what's that? Replay? I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. Carolina wakes to strange noises from her backyard. She goes to check, but her lights seem to be malfunctioning. When she steps into her backyard, someone or something seems to be lurking behind a tree. Its dark silhouette just oh, barely visible. Oh, and with yeah. that, Carolina has had enough. She decides to just get out of there. You can follow Carolina's continuing creepy story on her TikTok at Carolina Giselle. Yo, why, why y'all ladies actually like do that? Like, hey, why? Like, why? In another bizarre video, you you from the TikTok account Seok Seok Chat. She she kind of bad though. She kind of bad. No, is asking Siri random questions with her friends when suddenly things take a chilling turn. Kind of bad. Kind of bad. Which I, I hope it happens again. My sister, hey, my sister Siri randomly did this and it wasn't happening to anyone else. I'm genuinely terrified. Please, someone explain. Wait. What is plasma in blood? According to wikipedia.org, blood plasma is... What? As the liquid component of whole blood. Yeah. <laughs> See, he was having the orgay. I, I, can I say that word on YouTube or not? Probably doing Easter eggs, let's just say. Probably was having that orgasm. And makes up approximately 55% the total blood volume. Oh my god. Yuyu claims that she and her friends asked Siri multiple random questions. 
And the only time she got this strange response was after asking this one particular question. After a while, Siri's strange behavior returns back to normal. Yu Yu has no idea what happened, and to this day is still pretty freaked out by the strange occurrence. So oh, is this just him. a bizarre glitch in Siri's programming, or maybe even the phone? I'm not sure, but I'd be interested. It's probably a glitch. Probably a glitch. Let's to see. know if any of you have ever heard Siri do something weird. Or not a glitch, but probably was having an orgasm. You know, sometimes Siri gotta have its moments through numb machine. Weird like this. So please let me know down in the comments. Thoughts? Oh. Hide oh, number and one. seek. Oh snap, this is a long boy, it's gonna be bad, man. Jordanian Snapchat live streamer Ahmad Salhi travels to an allegedly haunted and abandoned house in the remote countryside of Jordan. Locals Jordan. believe the house to be haunted. Is he an or Arab co center? Dude, I'm hyped. By an evil jinn or spirit. Yeah, it is! It is, bro! Jinn, okay, I'm Muslim, so. Jin is basically means ghost, so yeah. When Ahmad is showing the exterior of the house to his live Snapchat audience, viewers spot something that Ahmad doesn't see. Bruh, like, I need to get... The first time we, so we explored the part that was open? All of this do you see? That's the house of the guy who killed Habibi. I'm not going. Okay, I might make two or three videos here. Long, dude. The place is too big. There are ten windows. Pray for me for my friends. In one of the windows up on the second floor, a dark shadow figure can be seen. Now, because it's a live stream, it's hard to tell what this blurry shape could be. It could easily be explained as a trick of the light, or maybe even the dark object or doorway inside the room. But then, Ahmad starts hearing strange sounds from that same window. Same window? Bruh. Look, the window is opening and closing. My god, it's open. There it is. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. You gotta pray longer, bro. There is something there, look. Thank you for subscribing, Brawny. That's probably on my main channel. Thank you, brother. Hey, 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 my God, there's a sound. After Ahmad Salhi hears the odd slamming sounds, he finally decides to go inside the creepy building to investigate. That's when things get a bit weird. Oh, oh snap, bro, this is bad. Bismillah. Did you see it? Yeah, 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 yeah. As Ahmad turns around, the small head of what appears to be a child can be seen peeking from behind the doorway. The face quickly retreats, and when Ahmad rushes over, no one there. Uh -oh. He hears a sudden noise coming from behind him, and when he looks over, the keys he used to open the entrance are dangling as if someone or something just touched them. Again, he walks over to check it out, only to be interrupted by another loud sound coming from where he just stood. If you look closely, you can see a shadow disappearing behind the corner. Yeah, Ahmad dude. continues to explore the building, Thank searching you, for any evidence of the unexplained activity. It seems that the presence in the house is toying with him. But then, when Ahmad opens the door to a new unexplored area, his already scary adventure becomes downright chilling. Eee, ow, this is it, boys. This is it. This Are you what? How you sick? There's the noise. Oh my god. Hey, there. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, yo, yo. Stop. No, die. Ah. Oh, Bismillah hey. ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Yamba! Bismillah. Yo. Oh. There was someone there. I need yeah, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Eh. Uh. Yeah. Yo, there was someone there. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, Bismillah. Bismillah. Bismillah, Bismillah, Bismillah. 
As soon as Ahmad opens the door, a mysterious child seems to take down a heavy mattress as he makes a run for it. Ahmad rushes forward and checks everywhere, but he's unable to find the boy. The child seems to have simply disappeared without a trace. So did Ahmad capture the apparition of a playful young child? Could it be that he captured a sinister, shape-shifting djinn? Let me know what you think. Damn. You can check out this full video over on Ahmad's YouTube channel. Bruh, like Todd's voice? That's wild. Click on this video on the screen. And I'll see you there. Subscribe.